Don't judge me. Wait, what should I say? Should I be, hey guys, hey YouTube. <laughs> hey guys. Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube video. Um, in today's YouTube video, I'm going to be talking about what's in my bag as a first year university student and what I carry around in my backpack every single day, like all my daily essentials and stuff like that. So this is my backpack. I don't know how you pronounce the brand of this. I think it's Full Jaw Raven. <laughs> And that's how I say it in my head, but I don't know if that's correct. Ugh, it's kind of heavy. It's not that heavy when I'm actually wearing it, but yeah. In the side pockets of the bag, in one pocket, I carry my keys. Um, this is the Lululemon keychain that I have um, because it's super big. I really like it. Um, and I think it's called like Never Lose Keychain, which makes sense because it's super big. You can't be losing it. Carry my student ID here. It used to be on a different lanyard, but I just attached it to this one so I can have it all in the same place. I also have my house keys. I also have my mom's. This is my mom's electric bike key um, for when I'm home and I use it. I have to lock it. So that's what that's for. This is the room to my boyfriend's room, <laughs> uh, just in case I want to break into his room. Um, this is my, oh, I can show that. Um, this is my house key back at home because right now I'm, I'm in a different city um, as my hometown. So when I'm home, that's the key I use. It's green. This is a keychain that I got from Prince Edward Island in Canada. Um, this is kind of tangled, but this is a bottle opener that I got as a gift, which is, I haven't used it before. So I don't know if I'll know how to use it when the time comes, but yeah a random rewards card i don't know i really do like this keychain just because it has this uh big what's it called um carabiner that i can just attach a shit ton of stuff to and yeah i like how big it is because i'll never lose it and it's pink by the way my boyfriend's right here um i asked him to come downstairs so i can film this video again because this is like my second time filming it um and i feel more comfortable when he's around oh so cute anyways in the second side of my backpack uh right now i'm carrying just like a random scent spray and this one is midnight afterglow from bath and body works i feel like um if i carried around an umbrella that would be more useful in that pocket um so i might you know switch it out for an umbrella but for now it's not really raining so i just carry around this random scent spray and it smells so good it's like a caramel vanilla scent and i really like gourmet sweet scents and yeah, also doesn't have a lid. Onto the front part of my bag, the little compartment. I use this part to keep all my um, like essentials that I usually grab for um, on a daily basis. I also have this keychain that I stole from my boyfriend. It's like a Lego, <laughs> little Lego character. Um, and yeah, thought it was cute. First things first, we have Aquaphor, obviously. Always an essential anywhere I go. Little scrunchy gum, because we don't want that stinky breath. I actually don't like this flavor, it's Midnight Mint. I don't know, I just picked it up. I usually like the green ones because that's spearmint and it's so like, mm, so good. This hand sanitizer from Bath & Body Works and Strawberry Pancake, which is my favorite um, scent. I was gonna say flavor, but I don't eat it. Uh, I just use this after like I go to the washroom. I double cleanse my hands after the washroom sometimes because um, bathrooms are gross. I have this little tin that I carry around. It was for chocolate mints and I got this from like a dollar dollar store. But I usually carry around um, change in here or any little trinkets that I find or I don't want to lose. If I take out my earrings, I'll put them in here. Um, but yeah, it doesn't have anything in it right now because I used up all my change. Next thing, I have my wallet. I like how it's yellow. Graham, are you bored? No. Okay, good. It's a bright yellow color because I easily lose things. So like my keychain, um, I like having my things in bright colors so I don't lose them. What is this? Oh, this is a card that I got when I printed my things, my posters at, what's it called, Staples? So, I don't know, it's just a preloaded card. Anyways, doesn't matter. Okay, so I really like this wallet because it's super small. I don't like the zipper wallets, like the really 
like the big long ones i don't like those so I like the dad wallets because they're easy to put in your pockets and they're um super small and compact i also like this one because it has this little uh what's it called dongle like this little clip where you can keep your cash and everything which is super helpful because i'm a server and i have a lot of cash that i have to deposit so this is where i keep it i also have my cards and stuff um which is totally none of your business oh and i have this cute picture of me and my family when we went to oh my dad's not in it but uh sounds like i don't have a dad um <laughs> this is when we went to mexico um and yeah it's a cute picture so i keep it like in the picture compartment of my wallet another cool thing about this wallet is that it has like a little secret compartment where you pull it up and then that's where i keep all my important important stuff so i like to keep it nice and secure and um secret next things are a couple lippies whenever i leave the house i usually grab um lip products and then um some well this one i use for blush I usually use this for blush. I like to carry lip products and um, blush, especially um, just to touch up. That's the only part of my makeup that I like to touch up. Or if I wear makeup at all that day, it has to be blush or any lip products. This one is like from, I think it's a Korean brand. I'm not sure. I stole it from my mom, so. This is a tinted lip balm from Essence. It's the Fruit Kiss, my favorite product. Um, this doubles as a lip or cheek tint, which is nice, and it is very long-lasting, so I like to carry this around all the time. And lastly, it's this little pin that fell off my the front of my bag because it lost its backing. Onto the main compartment of my bag. Oh my god. First thing in my backpack is my water bottle. My gigantic hydro flask. Can't fit it in like the side pockets, so I just keep it on top of the rest of my things in the main compartment, which is kind of bad if it leaks. It's the 32 liter, so it's pretty humongous, but I like to carry it around because it reminds me to keep reminds me to keep drinking water um, because it's so big and it's rarely full, but... Next thing in my bag is the book that I am reading right now. It's called All Her Little Secrets. I just got back into reading, so I'm not that too far into it, as you can see. Sit on the bed if you want. I need help up. Can you help me up? No. Please. Shut oh. up. <laughs> Next thing, we have these two pouches. Uh, this gray one holds all my like electronic stuff, um, all my technology. So this is a USB that I picked up from Staples because I didn't have one. Or actually, my other one broke. And that was a terabyte of data. Or no, terabyte, terabyte of gigs. So... Wait, terabyte of gigs, does that make sense? Keep this brightly colored, like, I don't know what it's called, like attachment, so I don't lose it. And I can just wear it on my wrist if I have to. Like those teachers that would hold it like this. But anyways, next up we have um, my MacBook charger. Um, nothing to say about that. These headphones that I use to listen to music or plug into my laptop, because it also has, has a dongle so I can connect it to either one. I used to have AirPods, but they got lost, so I use these now. And then lastly, I just have this random USB-C charger, just in case. None of my devices use a USB-C, but I carry it around for my boyfriend, just in case he forgets his uh, phone charger, because I'm thoughtful like that. Next thing, this is where I keep all my stationery and pens and pencils, which I don't often use. Next up, we have my bullet journal. It is pink. I just write down basically whatever I have to do that day or um, any quick notes, not like class notes, but notes to myself. All this stuff clipped back here are just like random stuff from previous years, not even school related, but I pinned it back and then I'm just gonna use up the rest of this book because I don't like wasting paper. Any quick notes or anything are taken in this book. Next up, we have the Rocket Book. It's a really thin notepad with only a couple sheets of paper, but it's actually not paper. It's like this kind of paper that you write on with those erasable pens, and then you can quickly wash it off with 
um, like a wet cloth or something. So you take notes and then you can take a picture of it or something, or if you don't need it anymore, you can wash it off and then you can reuse the paper. And I really like it because again, I don't like wasting paper. So this comes in handy if I have any like notes to take, um, like handwritten ones, but I usually take notes on my laptop anyways, but just in case this comes in handy. At the bottom of my bag, I have these mittens because it is winter time in Canada. So I always have a backup pair just in case I'm with someone and they don't have gloves. I can just be like, here, I got you. If I leave the house and I forget to bring my gloves, I always have a backup pair, which is helpful. And I also got these from my boyfriend's mom. And these are from like Iceland, I think. So it's extra warm and they're like rabbit hide, I believe. I don't know. Next thing, we have a hair clip. Um, this probably shouldn't be at the bottom of my, ba my bag because it's actually very broken as you can see But I still use it. The biggest thing in my bag is probably my laptop and it doesn't zip up properly So I might need to get a new one, but it just houses my laptop Obviously, and this is where I do all my notes and take notes So it's very essential for me to have that when I go to school obviously so I can follow along with lectures type up my notes and you know do some online shopping if i get bored in the back compartment of my bag right here we have a couple things these are the glasses that i use um have been using recently i do use the glasses i had before as a backup pair just in case i forgot my glasses or i lost them it comes with a cleaning cloth so i can clean my glasses um on the go but yeah in the back as well i have my emergency pouch so I have pads, obviously. I have some band-aids uh, for myself or others if other people need them. And weirdly enough, I have dental gauze. I don't know why, but I always had this in my bathroom. So I thought it would be a good idea to keep it in my emergency kit just in case like someone's heavily bleeding. And in the back compartment as well, I keep a DS. I don't usually carry around a DS because um, I'm not super into playing games on this DS because it only has one game right now, a Pokemon game. This is actually my brother's, but I brought it to school with me. Um, I don't know, just because I, I was into DS gaming, but I have it in my backpack because I found this guy online who mods DS's for like 20 bucks. And I wanted to bring it to him the other day, but I got busy. So I'll probably bring this to him eventually so he can mod it, jailbreak it, whatever. And like when you jailbreak a DS, you can get like a thousand games for free. It's kind of insane, but it would be super cool to mod this. So that's my plans for this. And also in the back of my bag, I have this, oh, what's it called? Hypochlorous acid in this small bottle that I got from Amazon. Um, it's just good to spritz your face now and then. Say you go to the gym and then um, you sweat a lot. Just like a quick fix would be to spray this on your face. And if you're acne prone. It's pretty good as well. Also, that DS was like super dusty. It's just because um, I have a bunch of crushed Tylenol at the bottom of my bag because or I carried around Tylenol in my backpack like at the bottom and then I guess some of it spilt and got crushed. So now there's a bunch of powder, like white powder in my bag. So that's not a good look, but I promise it's not drug related or anything. But well, it, it kind of is because Tylenol is a drug but not that kind of drug. Anyways, that concludes what's in my bag. And that's what I carry around on the daily whenever I go to school or I go to the library to study. Um, that's what I always carry in my bag, all my daily essentials and whatnot. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it gave you some ideas on what to bring in your backpack for school. Um, but that's, that's what I carry. It might be different for everybody, but yeah. Let me know in the comments if you want any other videos because I enjoy talking videos like this. I feel like it's like one of my first ones kind of where I actually sit down and talk. I'm going to be posting more videos like this in the future. So stay tuned. Bye.